Frontotemporal dementia has been in the news more recently, unfortunately because of Bruce Willis's diagnosis. His family has been amazing about being open about what is happening to him and as a result to the family. It hit very close to home for me because my mom died last year here at home from frontotemporal dementia. I am a hospice nurse, I'm an end of life doula, and her death and the decline was heartbreaking for me. Um, so I wanted to give you a little bit of information about frontotemporal dementia because it is very unique uh, in that a lot of times memory is spared, at least until later stages of the disease process. So usually what we see is like in Bruce Willis's case where they talked about aphasia or the inability or difficulty speaking, it's the same thing that happened to my mom where she was unable to speak um, or had a hard time and for a long time I didn't understand why. We also see behavioral changes, personality changes, and movement changes. And I'll do some later videos on it, but I just wanted to explain that not all dementias are the same, they're all heartbreaking. Frontotemporal dementia is very unique though, in that it usually is not affecting memory upfront.